Let's go, sir. Let's go. Let's go. Good morning. Hello, everybody. Good morning. Hello, Rich. How are you? Oh, look at this fluffy man. You going pee pee right now, sir? You're so big. Oh, what is up, guys? Good morning. I know, I don't got any earrings. And this is what my, look at like his little butthole calamari ears, man. Ew, gross. So figured I should make a video this morning. Some people hit me up via email about a two-year-old female blackthroat monitor. Little girlfriend for my dude Onyx over here. So, they're gonna be here shortly. It's early, but uh, yeah, we're getting, we're getting moving now. I gotta go make sure the girls are okay. Put some freaking earrings on and a hat. And uh, let's get to seeing this little lizard. Let's see how she get Oh, look what we got here. Oh, can you see her down there? Hey, hey, sweet girl. How are you? <laughs> All right, so we got Courtney, oh. Kelly. Thanks, guys. They drove all the way down here from what, North Carolina? North Carolina. They hit me up, like I said just a second ago. They hit me up an email the other day. I was reading my emails on the way home. Sent an email saying that they have this female black throat monitor. I'm still waking up. Yeah, I haven't had my okay. coffee yet. They got this female black throat monitor. Obviously, I have Onyx, so I would love to have uh, a female to raise up for Onyx. Eventually, one day, you know, in the next, like, two or three years, you know, be possi possibly breed them. would be awesome. And uh, she was pretty much rescued by them. Originally, she uh, came from, you are saying, from Kevin. Yeah. McCurley, all right? So, originally came from Nerd, went to somebody, wasn't taken care of, wasn't fed, was super skinny, was honestly... She looks like she was dying, honestly, from that one picture you guys you guys showed me. I'll include the picture in here. And uh, you guys did a great job. She looks she looks pretty nice now. We'll take her out in just a second. We're going to go in the backyard. We'll probably go on the patio and take her out so that way she doesn't get all freaked out and try to, like, run out in this, uh, in my yard right now. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, let's go see how she looks. Awesome. She looks like she's got a good body weight, though. I'm, I'm excited. Yeah. All right, so check it out. So this is the big six foot vision. Obviously, I'm gonna get this cleaned and set up for her. We're not gonna put it, we're not gonna put her in here with it looking like that. But this is what she's been kept in, you said, for a while, right? Yeah. Two years. Dang, dude, that sucks. So literally, this poor lizard has been kept in this freaking tote. Ugh. She's gonna have a good home now, though. Yes. Here, I'm gonna hand this phone off to you so that way you can record me picking her up and see how she's gonna act. Hi, you are cute. Hello. So she's gonna be a little. She's gonna be a little whippy. Typical monitor. That's how Onyx is. Oh, there you go. Well, there you, you go, girl. Yeah. So she needs a good soak. I just soaked her two days ago. Yeah, she's just yeah. got like some stuck. stuck shit on her. Mm -hmm. But her body weight looks good. Her face looks good. Her scales look good. Her fingers are all intact, you know? That's something you want to really look for, too. Because mm -hmm. a lot of the times, when they're kept improperly, stuck shed will even cut off the circulation to their toes. Right. And their toes will fall off. Mm -hmm. But she has all her toes. She's got all her fingernails. Ooh, she's a good looking mother. Mine she's got her. I'd shake for same. everything that I could. She's about the same size as Onyx, too. Mm -hmm. Look how sweet she is. She's a little sweetie. You're going to do just fine now. Oh, man. I'm so excited. She is sweet. I know you would You're be. You're going to have a nice, good home. I yeah, had a few seven. people wanting it, and I told her, I said, mm -hmm. I, I went through six people mm -hmm. that's online. Mm -hmm. um, really? The only person I really wanted it to go to because of what you're trying to do here. And I know you had on it, so I was like, if I can get a hold of Tyler, that's where it's going, and you. As soon as I saw that, email, I texted you. Yeah. As soon as Literally. you got it. As soon as I saw that, it went in thirty minutes. I texted him. Where? Yeah, I just man. got the email on my way home, and I was like, "Oh God." I mean, I was going to try to do everything I could for his, but in North Carolina, I can't do that. I mean, cold winters. Our winters are all the heated box I want. Yeah. But I mean, even down here, people have problems. So what am I going to do there? Yeah, no, I'm going to get her set up real nice today. But yeah, you can see it's not. 
It's not like it's caked on there. It's just mm -hmm. one layer, which is fine. Well, it wouldn't even break oh, loose before I started to soak it. That. See how yeah. pretty she is right under there? Mm-hmm. Yeah, this stuff will all come right off. We're gonna get you looking good. Today. I tried to get some off yesterday, but she was just getting kind of. We didn't want to stress her out because we knew the ride was gonna stress her. Yeah, no, she looks like she's doing fine. What yeah, is she's chill. She's just chill little sweetheart. I actually picked her up one day on my way home from now on my way to work. She's so cute. They just left, and it is time for me to get my new baby girl situated. I am so excited and very thankful. I don't. I've been very busy lately and it's hard for me to keep up all my emails and you guys that email me for booking and all that stuff know that it takes me a week or two to get to my email sometimes just because I'm so busy throughout the week and I do my emails myself for reasons like this rather than have somebody do my emails and you get an automated message from somebody else I like to make things personable I like to reach out to people myself I like to talk to people myself and engage with you guys personally okay the whole reason for doing this especially for getting tattooed like i don't want to email somebody about getting tattooed and then talk to their assistant you know what i mean it's just like it's this whole fiasco it's just not the way that i like to do things so anyways on my way home from work was checking my emails thankfully these people hit me up and i cannot be happier because this is such a beautiful little animal getting some new mulch put in here i'm gonna leave this in here for the basking this is where the basking light is i'm gonna leave this little basking area for her I have a bunch of pieces of driftwood and stuff I'm gonna kind of set up in here so that way she can crawl up that to crawl up on there. Put the water bowl over there, hide box pretty much in the middle. And then dude, this nice big six foot vision cage is gonna be perfect for her. What a huge upgrade because dude, she's been living in this little tiny tote box for the last two years. Literally her, her whole life, she's lived in a little plastic container like this. I feel terrible about that. Thank God she looks the way that she does. You see in that picture from before, she was looking super rough even when they got her. So I'm gonna finish getting this set up in here. And then I'm gonna take her out and empty out that tote. And I'm gonna give her a nice soak. That way she can uh, shed her skin a little bit. Hi. I have an idea. What's your idea? Hello. Hello, little baby. How are you? She's very cute. She's so cute. So her name is Black Betty. And I don't know how we feel about Black Betty. You like Black Betty? I still like maple. You like maple? maple? Yeah, like that was the whole goal. Yeah, or the like whole, maple. I don't know, what we, when we got Onyx. Can I pet her? Yeah, of course. Yeah, pick her up. So when we got Onyx, we wanted yeah, to, nice obviously, we knew that we wanted to breed them eventually Hi. and get a female. So and we nice. wanted to get a female and name her Maple, which is a really cute name. And... Aww. Black throat monitors smell like maple syrup also, so you know it kinda goes hand in hand. Ooh, 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 ooh. You got a fresh tack. You gotta be careful. Oh. Oh, you're getting whippy. Oh, you're getting whippy. Don't you be whippy. Hey, excuse me. Come here. She's you, so much nicer than Onyx. You relax. Onyx. You relax yourself. Oh, she's definitely a little sassy too though. There you go. You are very, very cute. So we're gonna give her a nice soak and try to get this stuck shed a little bit loosened up on her. But dude, she's a beautiful animal. Look at this, she's so pretty. Hi dude, you're awesome. You're in a nice new awesome home. You're gonna have a great life now. I don't know, it's probably, ew, of course, she just pooped everywhere. Gross, now I gotta change your water. You Sicko. Like, you don't like cleaning poop, huh? Oh, yeah. she pooped in her water. You know all about poop on yourself, huh? You don't like cleaning poop, huh? Oh, you did a poop, baby. You did a cutie. What do you think about your new your new lizard, huh? You like it? Yes? Give me a smile for yes. Yes. Give me a little yes smile. <laughs> there we go. Oh, you love her. <laughs> Booyah. There we go. Nice and clean. Got the glass nice and spotless. We got some fresh water in there. We got a hide box. We got plenty of area for her to climb around and get up on her basking spot. I'm going to turn this light on at night. It's a red heat bulb. Um, it's obviously, you can see, it is pretty much summertime here in Florida. It is getting plenty hot out here. All right, look at that thing. Woo! So, yeah, no need to put on heat right now because during the daylight, it's real toasty out here. Plenty hot for her. Her name. Change her name? Yeah, comment down below, guys. What do you think we should do? Keep Black Betty 
or change your name to Maple. Maple I really Betty. like Maple. Maple's Betty really cute. Betty, Betty cute? Maple Betty? I don't know. Comment down below. Let us know what you think. Hello. Hello. Is your skin coming off nice? Is your skin coming off? Can we get that? Are you, is it coming off there? Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Hey. There we go. The misting system. Real cool on these guys. It's working. Doing great, guys. Repty Zoo. Link down below. Hey, look how pretty she is. Hey, relax. Look at this. Look at her pretty spots. Like, she is actually really pretty. Once all this crappy stuck shed gets off of her, she's a really pretty lizard. She's got good body weight to her now. Hey, you. How are you? You're so cool. Poor thing's been living in that little box her whole life. It's crazy. Moment of truth. You're a new cage, sweetheart. Here you go. Look at that. Look at how much better that is. Look at all the room she's got. Way better. Oh, nice. And then soon, I'll build you a nice outdoor enclosure like your boyfriend. And you can stay right next to him. Keep you outside in the sunlight. Speaking of your boyfriend, let's go check on how he's going and then we'll close this video out. But look how pretty she is. She's gonna be just fine here. Hello, how are you? Show you guys how Onyx is doing. This cage is holding up great. Hey, dude. We gotta clean out your water today too, huh? You just ate yesterday and you pooped everywhere, dude. Let's get, every, let's get you out, show everybody how you're doing. Look at this little guy. He's, hey, excuse me. Do not bite me. See, he's got a little bit of a feeding response when he's in his cage. But once he's out, he is a gentleman. But look, look how pretty he is. Now, he's got a really cool pattern on him, too. He doesn't really have, like, closed circles on his back. He's got more of, like, a undefined pattern. He's getting big. Look at that. Look at that, man. Hey, dude. How are you, Onyx? You are a cute lizard, my friend. My little friend, Onyx. You sweet man. Don't bite my ears or my face, okay? You be a nice, nice lizard, okay? Yeah, okay, you lick my face. Give you a little kiss. So that is it, guys. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Kelly, Courtney, thank you so much. Holy crap, Onyx is trying to... Oh my God, Onyx is on the move. Oh, dude, relax. Oh my God, he's being crazy. He's trying to get away. I don't want to have any escaped. Hey, Travis, look at this. Travis, get out of there, dude. Get out of here. Onyx is gonna eat you. Pain in your butt. Get out of there. All right, let's try this again. Whew, Onyx was trying to get that sunlight. Once, he hit, once that sunlight hits him, they get all nimbly bimbly. He had a taste of the wild to get all crazy. He wants to run and be free. Can't have that. No, sir. Last thing we want is, that would be really cool though, if I had wild black throat monitors on my property, just, you know, basking in the sunlight everywhere. That would be really cool, but. FW Sheep would not like that very much. You know what I mean? So that is it. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Super stoked about Black Betty, Maple, whatever you guys want to call her. Comment down below. What should we name her? It's really freaking hot out today, but I got to go get in that snake shed. Got to clean out all the snakes today. Give everybody new waters, new substrate, all that stuff. I got Lance on his way over here to come help me out. So until next time, guys, I appreciate you watching. TylerNolanTattoos.com for all of your merch. I'll see you all in the next one. Thank you guys for your support. Love you. Appreciate you. God bless. Peace out. Goodbye.